now become the world's largest film market. What does this mean for the China's filming industry? Here are my answers. In 2020, amid the COVID-19 pandemic, China became the world's largest film market for the first time in history. According to data from Chinese ticketing platform Moye, China's 2021 box office revenue has exceeded 3.3 billion US dollars, almost equal to the total ticket sales for the whole of 2020. Thanks to strict countermeasures, China was able to control the spread of the pandemic, and work is now back on track. Even as Hollywood still struggles with theater change closing, China's film industry has already recovered strongly. In the future, Chinese films may dominate the box office. This year, nine of the top ten earners at the Chinese box office were domestic productions. China has traditionally been a key market for American films, but it has grown increasingly self-reliant in recent years. With a growing number of higher quality local work competing with imported productions. Now I'm at the Feng Xiaogang's film town. This place offers visitors, shops, restaurants, film themed entertainment features, and a Chinese version of the Walk of Fame. At the same time, some of the most famous Chinese films are also produced at here, like the film Youth. 没有给你回信，是怕连累你和你的妈妈，怕影响你在部队上的进步。Does this business model sound familiar for you? That's right. China is trying to build its own Universal Studios. When talking about the revenue in the film industry, people always think it comes from selling film tickets. But theme parks are also a big part of this part. With the rapid development of China's tourism and the increasing numbers of Chinese film IP, perhaps in the near future, China will also have its own Disneyland. If you want to know more about Chinese film industry, ask Melody. I will see you next time.